The science of time is a noble science that reveals the secret of eternity. Only the elites of sages may ever come to know this secret. It is called the first age, or the age of ages, from which time is emerging. Paraphrasing Ibn al-Arabi, The Meccan Revelations, Volume 1, page 156. Dr. Muhammad Hajj Yusuf dedicated his life to study the reality of time, and formulate it into a complete theory of physics and cosmology. He started in the 1990s, while he was at Cambridge University, and he published several books on this interdisciplinary subject. He spent more than two decades, of ceaseless investigation and searching through the remarkable heritage of ancient manuscripts of discounted philosophies and mystical Sufi traditions. Comparing all that with the fundamental results of modern physics theories. As a result of his studies at Exeter University in 2005, he introduced the single monad model of the cosmos, which was first published in 2007 and edited again in 2014. In 2017, this model was developed into the duality of time theory, which exposes a deeper understanding of the real flow of time and perpetual creation of space. The complex time geometry, which results from the duality of time theory, explains how the nested physical dimensions of space are being sequentially recreated, in the inner levels of time which makes the outward time genuinely imaginary with respect to the real flow of time that is creating space and matter. This critical concept of perpetual recreation allowed space to become naturally granular, and easily expressed in terms of simple Euclidean geometry, together with the hyperbolic split complex numbers. In addition to making gravity a full quantum field theory, the duality of time does not only unify all the fundamental interactions in terms of its genuinely complex time-time geometry, but it unifies this whole physical world with the two other even more fundamental domains of the psychical and spiritual worlds. All these three conclusive and complementary realms are constructed on the same concept of space-time geometry that together form one single absolute and perfectly symmetrical space. Since rigid space is created sequentially in the inner time, energy may become negative, imaginary and even multidimensional. Which simply means that all things in creation are various kinds of energy moments that are spreading on different intersecting dimensions of time, so not only mass and energy are equivalent, but also charge and all other physical and metaphysical entities are interconvertible types of energy, including consciousness and information. According to this recreation principle, there is no motion in the common sense that particles, gradually and infinitesimally move into new positions. But they are recreated in these new positions that could be at the other end of the universe, without violating the speed of light limit. This explains the non-locality problem, as well as many, if not all of the major problems in physics and cosmology. The homogeneity problem, for example, will instantly cease. Since the universe no matter how large it could be, is ray created sequentially in the inner levels. So all the states are updated and synchronized before they appear in the outer level of time that we encounter. This innovative concept will therefore provide the first logical interpretation of quantum behavior that explains the wave-particle duality and the collapse of wave function. The duality of time theory lead to many groundbreaking conceptions and conclusions. 
deeply related to the core of natural philosophy and even mathematics, or geometry and number theory, in addition to physics and cosmology. It will lead at the same time to all the philosophical and mathematical principles of modern quantum and relativity theories. Joining them together in a unique manner that is capable of solving the current discrepancies. While also joining together the various scientific arenas and offering many possibilities for extraordinary future applications. Happy reading! Please visit the Single Monad website for more discussion, and we welcome your comments and interaction in the forum.